Hi, in this video, I will review the basics of sponsored ads on Google search results. By watching this video, you will understand how your ads will show on Google and what each part of an ad means. Typically, this is how a sponsored ad from Google Ads can show on Google search results. The ad is consisted of different parts which you need to set up in Google Ads in order for your ad to show in an optimized and effective way. Let's review each part of a text ad together. Headlines You can provide up to 15 headlines for your ad, but the number of headlines should be at least minimum 3. Each headline can be maximum 30 characters. Your ad in search results will show maximum 3 headlines, but it might show only one headline. This is out of your control. Google can show your headlines in any order. If you want any specific headline to always show as headline 1 or 2, you can pin that headline so that it shows only in that specific position. When writing your headlines, try to include at least one of your keywords in your headlines and create headlines that are relevant to the keywords you are targeting. Focus on providing as many unique headlines as you can. Try highlighting additional product or service benefits, a problem you're solving, or shipping and return information. Descriptions Descriptions are longer text up to 90 characters that show below headlines. You can provide four descriptions but minimum two descriptions is mandatory. Google might show either one description or two descriptions together when showing your ad. Similar to headlines, you can pin descriptions so they always show in position one or position two. If you use separate sentences in your description, Google might truncate the description and only show one sentence at a time. So make sure each sentence in your description makes sense alone. Site links Site links are additional links that you can show below your ad and you can use to send people to specific pages on your site. One of the important benefits of site links is that it can help your ad to get a bigger real estate on search results page which increases the chance of click on your ad and also sends the competitor ads lower on the page. Your site links must contain one headline up to 25 characters and two descriptions up to 35 characters. Sometimes your site links show fully with both headline and descriptions and sometimes only the headline shows in smaller size. Callouts Callouts are short text or phrases that can improve your text ads by promoting unique offers to shoppers, like free shipping or 24-hour customer service. You can show up to 10 callouts in addition to the text of your ad, but it's up to Google whether it will show your callouts or not. A good rule of thumb is to provide more general information that's applicable to your entire business, such as 24-7 phone support. There are other assets too that you can use in your ads and I will quickly go through them. Structured snippets Assets that highlight specific aspects of your product and services. Structure snippets show beneath your text ad in the form of a header, for example destinations, and list of values, for example Hawaii, Costa Rica, South Africa. Location asset. By connecting your Google business profile to your Google Ads account, you can show the information of your physical store or your location below your ad so people click on it and find you on the map or call your store. Promotion asset. You can highlight your sales and promotions to people when they see your ad 
in an easy to read format that catches the eye of your potential customers. Image asset. Image assets allow you to upload visuals to complement your existing text ad. The compelling visuals of products or services can enhance the message of your text ads and increase the chance of click-through rate. Google can show multiple images in your ad, so it's strongly recommended to take advantage of this feature and upload relevant images. Business name and business logo. These two can add your business information to the top of your ad, which can leverage your brand equity. There are many factors to consider when you write and create your ad copy in Google Ads. I hope you found this video helpful and gained a good understanding of different elements in text ads. If you have any questions about ad copy in Google Ads, please share it with me in the comments. Thank you.